Hey guys, I'm Yash. Today I will show you uh, how to use image picker. Uh, using this, uh, you will be able to pick images from local photo library. So let's get started. Create a new Xcode project. Single view application. Name it image picker. Uh, do match this settings. Hit next. Save it wherever you want. Under uh, storyboard, we need an image picker, an image picker. Drag it over here. And we'll occupy full screen. And uh, let's give some constraints. Zero from top, zero from left, zero from right, and zero from bottom. And uh, hit add. So now we need to connect this uh, image view to our Swift file. So control drag and uh, name it image view. Okay. Hit connect. So now we are done with the storyboard part. So let's hop over to view controller and uh, change it to standard editor. Now here uh, we need two protocols. First is navigation controller delegate and another one is image picker controller delegate. Okay. So uh, on uh, clicking anywhere on the screen, we will be popping out the selector image picker. So we will be overriding touches begin function. So just type in touches begin and hit enter. You will get the completed code. So under code, we will first create a controller. Controller. It will be of type UI image picker controller. Here it is. Uh, don't forget this parenthesis. First, uh, we need to define its uh, delegate. So it will be controller dot delegate is equal to self. And uh, one more thing is controller dot uh, source type from where we want to select uh, which options we need to show it uh, show to user. So this is an enum. So just hit dot. We will get three options: camera, photo library, and save photo albums. Uh, I will be selecting photo library. After doing this, we need to present this controller. Present, open parenthesis, uh, hit enter. So our controller will be controller. Animated will be true. And completion handler will be nil. So we are done with the touches begin part. Uh, now we need two more functions. First is image picker controller did cancel. So if user did not select any image. So just type image picker controller did cancel. This is the function which we need. So hit enter under code. We just need to type dismiss true and completion handler again nil. And uh, the last function we need is image picker controller did finish picking media. So just type did finish. Uh, okay, here it is. So did finish picking media with info Now our photo our image will be in this array info array. So let's grab it Let's create a constant selected image info and of UI image picker con controller original image. Okay, and we will downcast this to UI image so now we have our image in this constant. So now we just need uh, to assign this image to our image view. So it will be simple image view dot image is equal to selected image. So we are done with the assigning part. Now we need to dismiss the control type dismiss animated true and completion handler will be nil. So we are done with the coding part. Uh, now we need to uh, ask for permissions uh, permission from user to use the photo library. So under info.plist uh, on the first line hit add and type privacy with P capital uh, go down. You will find a photo library usage and there's dot 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 uh, hit enter. Now we can pass in our personal customized message. Uh, I'll say let me use it. So uh, hit run. Now the app is running app is loading first it will ask for the permission so I think uh, yeah app is running so click here so this is a permission hit ok select an image so this is how we can set the image 
uh, we can do one more thing or uh, we can hide this status bar and uh, also what we can do is first let's initiate it with a color under view did load type image view dot background color uh, so we can know that uh, app has uh, started and it's running so it will be ui color dot light gray and uh, let's hide the status bar uh, when the image is selected okay so no we can do it overall for the app so after view did load uh, this is again a function so status so prefer status bar hidden just open brackets and uh, return true so this will hide the status bar let's run the app again now this time it will not be asking for permissions because we have already selected it and we have uh, given the permission so what happened I'll restart it run okay simulator is running where is my simulator okay here it is so phone is loading I think that's loaded app will run so now we have light gray color so hit a uh, click here select an image now it looks more cooler as the bar is not present so this is how you select image from photo library thank you guys keep watching